breaking news this morning. We're hearing from one of the surviving victims of the Parkland shooting. A young woman who was shot multiple times just spoke about her recovery and how the community is rallying around her. News Channel 8's Amanda Shavari, she is live now in the Tampa News Center with a listen to what this young woman had to say. Amanda. Marco, this young woman is incredible. She's a junior at Stoneman Douglas. On Valentine's Day, she was shot multiple times in the chest, stomach, and arms. But thanks to the incredible work of first responders and her doctors, Maddie is alive. Especially all the love that everyone has sent. And I was sitting on my couch today just thinking about all the letters and gifts everyone has given. And just like all the love that's been passed around, I definitely wouldn't be here without it. And I just want to send my appreciation and love out to all of you and um, that, like my mom said, it's times like these when I know that we need to stick together. That was Maddie Wilford. Today, doctors who treated her also spoke this hospital was all hands on deck on Valentine's Day. But Maddie's doctors remember her. She was pale, not responding, broken bones, and in shock. But they worked with her for hours, doing everything they could to save her, and it worked. With one man causing so much pain on this day, Maddie wants people to know about the love she has felt from the community ever since. Maddie thanked her doctors and first responders as she spoke. You just heard her there. She was emotional, but she was strong. Bettina is now back home, continuing her recovery. She and her family even met with President Donald Trump and the First Lady just a few days after the shooting. But Marco, incredible to hear the strength this young woman has. Yeah, and what a miracle that she's here today after everything her doctors did to save her.